Hi, it's Jeff here with Uari Outdoor Resources. I want to introduce you to the Mountain Smith Celestial Two Person Tent. This has gotten me through a few camping trips, including one in a uh, tropical storm on the Outer Banks. That was interesting. <laughs> but the tent was uh, tight, with the exception of one leak where the water was running up the outside and into the air vent, uh, stayed dry. And that was just a few drips. We're going to set it up for you, and then I'm going to give a great review here. Roll it out. Always keep the pole bags and stake bags. You don't want holes in your tent. One thing you will notice, even though we're on a pad, I went ahead and put down a ground cloth, a tarp. These little rocks will put holes in the bottom of your tent, even if it's been treated. These poles are simple. This tent is really easy to put up with one person, but if you have a trusty assistant, you can put it up really quick. Let's see, Let's put that in the hole. One trick I learned is to, once you get this in the hole, go ahead and start clipping some of the clips on. Um, it helps keep it more stable. And it's actually pretty easy. It's, grab that there. There are some hooks right here. You can just put over these to help keep it up. These clips are pretty awesome. One of the first tents I had like this had these sleeves you had to run the poles through. It just made it a little trickier. Now, if you're out here in this beautiful weather and sunny and, and warm, you may not want to put the fly on it. Uh, this is a three season tent gets a lot of air and this is nice but if it's going to be a heavy dew or rain even wind you probably will want to fly and this is easy to put on there's some Velcro straps up underneath that go around these poles. For the most part, you just drape it over. And you clip these corner pieces in here. I'll show you in a second. Here's one that you can see. There's a just a clip like you'd have on a backpack or anything else in and out nowadays with a web belt. Just clank it right in. There are more tie downs for wind. Uh, here's the vent that I mentioned. There's a little piece here that'll help us stand up. Like I said, I don't necessarily recommend we do that in the rain, but these these pull out. And one thing about setting up a tent, even if you're just talking about a heavy dew, you want to have all this tight. If you leave it sagging like we did here, sometimes water will pool in areas, like up in here. But if it's tight, it'll run right off and you won't have to worry so much about it coming through. I mean, even though they're basically waterproof, with the way nylon's made, if you push on it from the inside where you have a pool of water, you have a chance of it leaking. Uh, it's a great tent. I love it.